Hello, this is Uncle Russ coming to you again this week with more comic books for sale at Lot 22 Sellers on eBay. Also going to talk a little bit today about Big Little Books. Very cold winter day. We're inside where it's nice and warm. Let's talk. Going to be concentrating today on one of my all-time favorite Marvel characters, the Mighty Thor. Here we have issue number 286. Going all the way back to 1979. Written by the great Roy Thomas with artwork by Keith Pollard. This is an early entry into the Thor title. This could be yours today for $3.99. And next, another issue of the Mighty Thor. Going back to 1982. Issue number 315. Written by Doug Mitch. Once again with artwork by Keith Pollard. Fighting the Bye Beast. This is a bargain. It could be yours today for only $2.99. And here's an unusual cover. The Mighty Thor, issue number 319. The Zaniac craves blood. You may hate the name, but you'll never forget him. This is another a little minor classic in the Thor run. Also by Doug Bench and Keith Parlard with... Uh, Inks by Brett Breeding. This one is a bargain. Can be yours today for $9.99. Go. Next up, The Mighty Thor number 322. To fight a friend. Thor versus Heimdall. This one also written by Doug Mitch. With artwork by Alan Cooperberg and Jim Mooney doing the inks. This is about the battle on the Rainbow Bridge. This also, 1982. This can be yours today for $6.99. And the next one, Mighty Thor, issue number 323. Story by Stephen Grant, with artwork by Greg LaRock and Ricardo Villamonte. However, my favorite thing about this is the cover, because we have pencils by Ed Hannigan, and inks by one of my very favorite anchors, one of the greatest anchors of the Silver Age era, Vince Coletta. Much hated by many Jack Kirby fans for very good reasons, but I defend him and I'll stand by Vince Coletta. He was a very, very prolific and very, very confident anchor. Some of his lines are some of the most beautiful. And I really remember very well, I think he was probably the best anchor that uh, Jack Kirby ever had on this title in spite of their falling out. This issue can be had today for only $2.99. And finishing up today with our titles for sale, The Mighty Thor, number 334. There you have Dr. Donald Blake and Mighty Thor on the cover. This is an Alan Zellin. It's a uh, Written issue with art by Mark Bright and inks by the great Vince Coletta. He ain't not just the cover, but the entire issue is beautifully done. If you're a fan of his work, you will enjoy this. I really enjoy when uh, Dr. Donald Blake is included in the Thor mythos. And I think that's one of the great additions of Stan Lee to the mythos. This could be yours today for only $3.99. Hello, everybody. It's Ben Shrewsbury. This is Uncle Russ. And we are the Two Marks from the Two Marks and a Spark Wrestling Show right here on Lock 22. Be sure to check us out every single Sunday and sometimes Monday for all your professional wrestling needs only on YouTube.com slash Lock 22. One thing yeah, you notice if you uh, go to comic book stores and hang around comic book collectors, you'll find some also like to collect the big little books they're very much tied to the history of comic books and comic strips have been for many decades i first started to collect them in 1968 when newer editions of these came out unlike the previous editions these featured color artwork and uh 
I remember collecting these. I've got a dozen or so left, some of which are left from my childhood and some which I've acquired since then. But Dick Tracy, we've got uh, Lassie, Adventure in Alaska. These were published by Whitman out of Racine, Wisconsin, which was a part of the Western Publishing Company, which uh, also published Gold Key comic books. They published the comic books uh, for Dale, out of Dale Publishing in New York. They, you also know that uh, they published the uh, Little Golden books and hundreds and hundreds, probably thousands of different coloring books and puzzle books over the years. One of the things that was always a strength of them as a publisher and a comic book publisher is that they simultaneously held more licenses to publish material than just about any other publisher. They, in the comic books, they could publish anything by Looney Tunes, Walt Disney, Hanna-Barbera, Terry Tunes, all of these companies at the same time, plus uh, most of the popular television shows had comic books either published by Dell or Gold Key. This is from the second group that came out. Uh, in this initial run of these uh, ones from 1968 to about 1970, I believe there was 27 titles total. Here's a favorite of mine, Space Ghost. Big favorite. Aquaman. Here's a television series. <clears throat> a lot of you may or may not remember. Not that well known nowadays. Doctari. I hated this show for years because it, it got the network slot that replaced my favorite show, Lost in Space. But when it went off the air, we went from space aliens to animals. Nature show. And I'm like, oh, boo on nature. <laughs> Shazam which was another great Hanna-Barbera. And this was interesting, too. An adaptation of the movie version of Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, which was based upon a children's book written by Ian Fleming. So these are a lot of fun. I also want to mention we have uh, a big little book for sale, along with the comic books, at Lot 22 Sellers on eBay. This is Mandrake the Magician. This is one of the original big little books. It's a little bit worn condition, but for its age, it's in wonderful condition. 1935, written by Lee Falk and Phil Davis. Lee Falk is one of the greatest comic book collectors, or excuse me, comic book creators of all time, created both Mandrake the Magician and the Phantom. This is a, a real treasure, over 400 pages and intact could be yours for the ridiculously low price of $12.99. This along with the Thor books are available. If you want to inquire about uh, buying more than one item and consolidating them to save on shipping or to uh, even dicker about prices, we could do that. We're willing to talk to you about anything. Send us an eBay. Check us out at Lock 22 Sellers. Hopefully you found something that you like today. If you'd like to purchase any of these books, check for the links in the description below. There'll be more books for sale every week. Lot 22 Sellers on eBay. Lock 22, have a good day. Lock.